opening another Hello Kitty miniverse. So far, I think I have four or five of them. Let's, oh no. Why does this keep happening lately? The resin leaked out. Probably not salvageable. Maybe it is. I'm going to report it this time. I normally don't because I haven't had good luck in the past, but uh, I'm going to report it and see what they do. So this one, I'm going to set this aside. This one came with a mini post. That's cute. And it has some the beverages like the cappuccino and the shake and stuff. That's really cute. We got a newspaper. We, oh, this is the milkshake one. Yes, I've seen someone make this. So it's, I think it's just clear resin or white resin and you mix. So we can probably still make it because I have extra resins. But we have Hello Kitty whipped cream. Those just have like a strawberry built into it. That's cute. Oh, the plate. That's adorable. Um, I'm not going to open this. That's that same package that goes in here. Oh, actually, that has resin all in the inside. Cool. Um, these straws already have the bow on it. That's super cute. I like that. Don't have to attach anything there. Oh. The... Milk jugs, that's so cute. I remember seeing someone make this and thinking they should have mixed it separately and poured it. I might actually do that, I'm not sure. I guess it depends what our resin looks like. They did give you a spoon for stirring. That reminds me, so I just made the pie. I forgot to show you the pie server that came inside. Isn't that the cutest thing ever? Everything's branded, love it. Okay, so I'm probably going to have to, I wonder if I should put on gloves. Probably should, huh? I hate working with gloves, but it doesn't look like much leaked out. I wiped it off and I have this random piece left over. Um, it came in the packaging for the Harry Potter classroom set. So I'm just going to mix this and then it's kind of bendable. So I think maybe I could pour it into the bottles. About to find out. We're experimenting here. I think it'll be easier to pre-mix it. That way you don't have like any that's discolored or missing the pigment or any of that. I'm gonna try to put all of it in here so we can do it all at once. It's more of a flat surface rather than a bowl, but I'm gonna set that like that for a minute and get a toothpick. And I forgot to show you what we're making here. We're doing the strawberry milk. So cute. And yeah, it shows you putting the resin in there, adding the powder, mixing it, then adding the straw and the whipped cream and curing it. So we're doing a little bit different. See if there's any more in there. I'll probably go ahead and open the powder. And I guess I'll leave my gloves on. I could probably take them off at this point since we're done with the bottle, but um, I think it's all off on my hand. I hate working in gloves. That's my main thing. Does this have... Oh, it does. has an easy lift. I don't know if I still need to cut it. Find out in just a second. Yes, I do. I wanted to be able to reseal this, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. I'm going to cut it over here too, because I kind of anticipate it flying out. The powders they put in are... Ooh, that was a lot. They're often very messy. This looks like a crushed up Pepto-Bismol pill. I don't know if parents still make their kids take those when they... 
don't feel good, but I feel like if you grew up in my era, you know what I'm talking about. I probably added like way too much, but I think it's going to be pretty because it's going to be super pink. Not just a light pink. But also, like, why did they give you so much if you hardly need any? We don't know. Ooh, this will be a cool one to do if I have any leftover resin to make my miniature Hello Kitty mold. There are a little bit of like powdery pieces in here, so I'm just gonna give it a real quick mix. I think that looks pretty good. Better than doing it in a bottle, that's for sure. I think a lot better. Let's try to squeeze the side. Hold on. Something was telling me that I better put something under there just in case we make a mess. This is pretty bendable. I think if you hold it above so it drips straight in, that's working pretty well. I'm going to try not to wipe. on the lid. Where's the other one? Hurry! <laughs> it's about to drip. There we go. I didn't fill it up all the way because I don't know how much resin we lost. But I'll try to make them as even as I can. I like how bendable this plastic is though. It makes it easy and obviously disposable. Starting to slow down. I could probably scrape a lot more in though. It's kind of getting stuck right where I have it bending. Also can't tell if they're even or not. That one's pretty full. This one's like perfect. There's none running on the side of the glass. Let me see if I can switch hands. I don't know what you last heard because my, my memory card got full and it died. I think I have enough in here, but I don't know about the whipped cream. Because once you put the straw in, they're claiming it doesn't even come up high enough. They're saying you should have filled it like way up here. There's not enough resin for that. Maybe there wouldn't have been if it didn't leak out. Let me see how this would fit. Can we still put it in there? No. I mean, it's cute without it, but... Oh my gosh. I always preach to keep your leftover resin. I had some white icing stuff, which is a lot thicker, but I was able to mix up some and kind of fill it. I'm going to still see if this fits, but yeah, it's just going to sit barely on top. I'm going to rush this outside and painstakingly fill that one. Okay, these turned out cute despite the hurdles we had to go through to get this. <laughs> um, only one little area I saw. So where is it? Right there. You can kind of see in there, but no biggie. I think these are very cute. Let me see what I would rate them out of 10. Um, maybe like a seven, seven and a half. I do like the look of this and I like the tray they put it on. Adorable. And the table and stuff was salvageable. If you ever get resin on anything, um, someone told me a long time ago to use like alcohol or alcohol wipes and that takes the stickiness away um, and then I just I did that to the table and everything and the resin came right off and I stuck everything outside to cure so that it could still be used so 
was salvageable. I don't know that I'll contact them. I don't know what you need to prove it leaked. I took a picture of it in case um, I need to claim it, but I mean, I was able to make it, so I probably won't claim it. But anyways, I have many more of these, and I have the new Spa series too, which I'm not super excited about because I don't want to make bath bombs anymore, but we'll see. I'll at least do a few of those so you can see what Series 2 looks like and what all comes in that one. Thanks so much for watching. Bye, guys.